Something came in the mail today, guys. From By Truck Wheels. Shout out to these guys for hooking a brother up. Oh boy, you guys don't even want to see. See that one. Everybody knows what the regular dually wheel looks like. You don't want to see us inside of this one. For our beloved fire truck, we got to get this thing looking nice for the uh, Redneck 500 or Redneck 100. But dang. Ooh. Ooh. Dang. Super single aluminum. Like what's on the truck now, obviously, but in aluminum wheels. To go on the front. They are polished out beautifully to go on the fire truck. So um, today we're going to be getting the fire truck pulled up to the back door um, and getting the tires and wheels off of it broken down. I'm going to probably going to try to do most of them myself and uh, get these bad mothers put on here. Mm, they look so pretty. And also we're in the middle of cleaning white lightning out. I got all my junk out of it and some boxes and all this crap. I currently don't have a truck to drive right now, so got to start figuring that out. But uh, my buddy Seth's up here. He's getting the truck cleaned out. The new owner is literally probably like 30 minutes away. He drove all the way from Atlanta. And big surprise, guys, the Cherokee, Dodge Cherokee is driving, or Jeep Cherokee, he's driving down. He's actually leaving with me. He's like, bro, I don't even need it. You can have it. So we'll see what that Cherokee looks like when he gets here. Guys, I legit haven't even cleaned this thing like since I got it. The carpet is a little rough. Yeah, it's a little dirty. But clean. truck cleans up nice from the inside at least. All right, you guys, we made up here the tire shot. There's a lot of monotone of uh, copyright music playing, so we can't really record too much, but I'm gonna do a little time lapse and let's get the tires changed out. Our new rims put on over there, baby. They're gonna look so sick. Shout out to buytruckwheels.com. Mmm, that'll look so good. Good. Not the first person. <laughs> do what? <laughs> You're not the first person. I'm not filming it like for liability. I mean like I have a YouTube channel. Yeah, for YouTube. That's what, really I've had a couple people do that for YouTube and stuff. My full time job, homie. Well this. Quite a fire truck with your YouTube buddy. Big ol' ass disc brakes, boys. Holy crap. Dang. There they are, guys. One tire down. Three more to go. So there it is, guys. The fire truck's got her new aluminum wheels on it from Buy Truck Wheels, and it does look so sexy, guys. Make sure you go check them out in the description below. Great people. They actually sent us some wheels for the school bus that we had that we sold a while back, and they were wrong. It was my fault, not theirs, but it's kind of glad it didn't work out because we ended up selling it, but these things look so good. We got, we're gonna be putting hub caps on them and painting the rear uh, hubs black and all that good stuff, but we just filled it up with water only because my freaking town is going nuts. People are buying up like everything. People are running out of fuel. So we filled this up, pulled the fuel, holds 50 gallons of diesel. Um, we're getting the mega truck moved to the shop tonight. We're gonna get it filled up full of fuel and go buy a bunch of diesel for that. I just don't want to run out of diesel for making videos to you guys. And uh, yeah, we're getting prepped. So we're gonna head back to the uh, town now and get this thing dropped off. All right, guys, we're back at the shop. Brad brought the mega truck up here and we're leaving it on the trailer. I'm gonna try to hit it with a pressure washer as best I can. And we're headed right to my buddy Rob's shop down in Stewart, Florida. Um, you guys are gonna be in the area. Maybe you can hit me up and come check it out. Uh, we're gonna work on putting bump stops on the truck working on uh, revalving the shocks and getting this thing ready to jump because we're gonna go full send. He actually has a private track at his shop that we're gonna be jumping at and testing and doing things like that. So um, yeah, we're gonna get pulled in there and pressure wash a little bit and then uh, get it ready for the road tomorrow.
Brad just waxed his truck. Thanks. Oops. I love water spots. Thank you. Well, it's all clean. Brad's over there jacking off. Um, I'm going to get the fire truck pulled inside, get it parked. I got to fix the water leak too. I forgot about that crap. But the flat express ready to go for tomorrow um, at Rob's. We're going to be bringing a lot of other cool stuff I've got in the shop with me tomorrow to put on the truck wire at his shop from a few companies. So get ready for that, guys. Um, but yeah, fire truck's full. So uh, see this thing pulled around back, and I've got a little surprise for you guys in the, the video. So hold tight. Don't go nowhere yet. Well, guys. I sold White Lightning, my white 98, and we're gonna be bumming it in some trucks for now until I get a new truck in a couple weeks or month, whatever. And uh, my buddy, or the guy that bought White Lightning said, hey, I'm driving this Jeep down. I don't know what to do with it. Do you want it? I'm like, uh, yeah. So we worked a little bit of a deal. Got the Jeep Laredo. It's got a V6 in her. She's a freaking banger. Brad likes it. Let's see, she starts to fire right up, hopefully. A runner that ain't all the red that's not into the ketchup though it's got cold ac too let me go see how she let me go uh test drive it let me see how to test drive it Oh, does that window work? <laughs> yeah, this was broken. It. Hey, but the e brake works. Yoink. <laughs> yoink. Is that how it goes? Yoink, Fred, or a yeet? No, that's a yoink. Yeet. Yoink. Yeet. Yoink. I got traction control. I think that's the problem. How do I turn this stuff off? Nope. Nope. We're just gonna we're gonna yeet it. Hang on. Almost got it. <laughs> I gotta tap it. It needs a wall tap. I gotta break her in. Y'all seen a Jeep off road like that, but it's better than most of y'all can say. I tell you what, <laughs> I don't know what we're gonna do with this thing. This is either gonna be our demo car for Cletus and Cars. We gotta wait, we gotta wait for Cletus and Cars, and then maybe Ranch Out. Pass the last one in comments. Do you want to see this thing last until Cletus and Cars come April, or do you want us to see us destroyed at uh, Rancho? Start comment down below, let me know. Well, Flatty's loaded up our uh, little expedition. The thing's almost too nice for a demo car. Jeep, yes. Our Yeep over there. Uh, be looking at Wednesday. Brad's going to be uh, auctioning it off or selling it. We don't know yet. <laughs> Make sure you smash the like button, drop a comment down below, and tune into tomorrow's video. We're going to be tearing into the mega truck and doing all kinds of cool stuff. Cab over content coming later later this week, guys. So be ready for that. Don't forget to go to the Facebook link below, Bogman Bruce, and come out to Rancho with all of us this weekend. Dutt will be there with his uh, side by side and all kinds of cool stuff. All of us will be out there chilling, having a good time. We'll have some merch with us too. 
and go to bristleshop.com grab your merch go to buytruckwheels.com and grab your uh fire truck wheels all kinds of cool stuff there see ya